In this question, the photoelectric effect is investigated using different metal surfaces and light with different frequencies, and we have to decide which statement about this experiment is correct. We will use this equation from subtopic 12.1, where E max is the maximum kinetic energy of the emitted photoelectrons, H is Planck's constant, F is the frequency of the incident light, and phi is the work function of the metal surface. Now note that this equation corresponds to the equation of a straight line, y equals mx plus c, that you learn about in mathematics. You might have come across a slightly different form of this equation, for example, y equals ax plus b. However, the important thing here is that m, or the letter in front of x, represents the gradient, or slope, and C represents the vertical axis intercept. Since in our question we have a graph of maximum kinetic energy versus frequency, Y equals MX plus C corresponds to the equation on the right side from subtopic 12.1 this way. Since in the experiment we are changing the frequency and the work function, which influence the maximum kinetic energy, these three values vary from trial to trial and from metal surface to metal surface. Since H is Planck's constant, it always remains the same no matter what happens to the maximum kinetic energy, the frequency and to the work function. Since H corresponds to M, which represents the slope or gradient of the line, we can conclude that the lines showing how maximum kinetic energy varies with frequency have a constant slope, which means that the answer to this question is C. As an additional note, all other answer options can be eliminated because they change due to the changing work function of the metal surface.